Three rounds into the AMA hill climb season for 1999, there are signs of a new order coming among the Wheels Up crowd. Here to bring you up to date on rounds two and three is Darren Mann. Our first stop on the Hill Climb Twofer, Jefferson, PA, and Hill Climb Road. First up in the 540 class, John Hamilton. He puts in the second fastest time of the day at 6.69, but will come up short on his second run at 220 feet. The fastest time of the day went to Chad Disbennett with his first run. His time was so strong, no one could touch him in round number two. In the 800 class, Tim Frazier puts in a 6.34 run on his Harley Davidson. Frazier was so pleased with his blazing time, he opted to take a bye in the second round. Glenn Petty was really the only person who could come close to Frazier's 6.34, but the man from Mooresville, Indiana, would come up short, giving the win to Tim Frazier. Jim Large followed Frazier and Petty. Mark Swem and David Watson rounded out the top five at White Rose Motorcycle Club. This past weekend, Hill Climb Road was in Freemansburg, PA. It was a road with, well, a little more personality. First up in the 540 class was Paul Pinsonow. Paul and his Honda setting the pace at 9.51 seconds. Well, the only man to come close to that time was John Hamilton at 9.77 seconds, which set up a great round two. Hamilton puts in this run at 9.25, bettering Pinsonow's round one time, forcing Paul Pinsonow to put in an incredible 8.89 winning the weekend. In the 800, there were only three men who could break the nine-second mark, one of them, Bob Templeton, at 8.76. Templeton would clinch the win, bettering his 12th place finish from the week before. The worst crash of the weekend came from Chad Disbennett as his run heads south right from the start. Ding dong! Hello, anybody home? I don't think we're in Kansas anymore. For Motor World, I'm Darren Mann. Thanks, Darren. I can see you on one of those babies in the near future.